Koyosoi, a British YouTuber that's more commonly known as a rapper, that one big forehead guy, or that one guy that keeps on showing in your Twitter feed because he keeps on raging over a tweet that Dan TDM put out two weeks ago, and the guy's been fighting with himself for two weeks at this point. That KSI, that KSI we're talking about, he released a new song, and uh, the internet, well, because of the situation right now with uh, the Dan TDM stuff, which you probably heard about, is uh, it's not going good for KSI, alright? Oh shit, I put KSI's new song on YouTube and this popped up. Streamers love KSI's new song. Exploding head emoji. Lit fire emoji. All right, I see Nick. Nick A30, aka the streamer that loves to scream at kids for not role playing correctly for Star Wars. Oh my God, bro. You're banned, brother. You're banned. You're gone from the custom. Well, let's check it out. This is the best line right here. Wait for it. Or whatever noise he made. My god, Nick A30 seems really excited for KSI's new song. Uh, you see, I haven't seen it yet, so I'm seeing it with Nick A30 in this uh, Sigma edit. I, I hate these edits, okay? I hate these edits. Whoever the fuck made it, it annoys me. But no, I love it, Kid Nick A30, man. Fortnite YouTuber. Hell yeah, man. He loves it. Let's continue. God! Okay, um, if you don't know, I need to mute the song because KSI label company is just beaming any video that puts his music on, so I put funk music on it. But second thing, Nick! Oh, come on, man! I love your Fortnite videos! I love it when you scream at them kids! But, Nick, man! What the fuck? Yeah! Yeah! Yeah, it, it's, uh... Okay. I, I, it might be the edits. I, I love Nick, okay, but my god, that's the whitest thing I've ever seen yet. But yeah, Nick seems to like it, which, you know, he's a fairly positive guy, so I mean, why wouldn't he like it, right? All right, everybody line up, or I'm gonna kill you. Line up. And then we have the other side of the, the, the scene with the vast majority shitting on it, saying that it's trash, and their eardrums are about to explode. And I mean, just seeing these memes is funny, but what's even funnier is KSI's reaction. He just reacts to every single one of them, okay? He actually takes it seriously he doesn't take it as a joke which is so funny and trust me i'm pretty sure none of this would have happened nobody would have shitted on his song that much if lunchly didn't exist it okay let, let me put it here okay lunchly came out with logan paul and mr beast okay very very criticized meal because they said oh it's a healthier version of lunchables yeah bullshit i mean yeah it's a bit healthier but still the same shit and you know partnering up with mr beast who has a lot of the allegations right now it's pretty bad in and of itself but then Dan TDM put out a tweet which you've probably seen over a million times at this point and KSI got angry he was like oh isn't this shit and he just put it like his toys and stuff like that's not the point man you're diverting the discussion what the fuck's wrong and the guy kept on getting community noted over and over and over again putting misinformation in his fucking Twitter attacking people who respond to him like the worst thing that he could have done in this situation is respond to the hate just leave it but he so thin-skinned that he just no he just he just went out and said oh this man called me a dumbass let me respond to him and they're like no what the fuck's wrong with you but maybe i'm giving too much shit on on case but i feel like i feel like if he would have done this if he even wouldn't have responded to dan tdm's tweet if he would have just left it all there i'm pretty sure he wouldn't have gotten this much shit but i haven't even heard the song maybe it's good so let's watch it together Alright, we're entering this already looks sick, okay? These mountainous areas, this floating text. Oh, I hear one guitar string. I'm about to get copyright strike. I'm muting the song now, but I'm pretty sure I'm gonna like it. Okay, we're entering the Arctic asshole. <laughs> oh my god, that's so disgusting. Oh my god, that chainsaw says thick of it. Okay, that's kind of stupid. <laughs> Pause, pause, pause. No, 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 no. Why is KSI blue? Why is he turning into a smurf? Okay, I know he's in the Arctic. He's frozen, man. They're trying to chainsaw him out of there. I know, I know, but uh, it looks kind of stupid. And I'm not gonna lie, but being too judgmental. I'm not entering the KSI hate train, all right? Oh! What the fuck, man? Stop promoting your shit in your music video. No wonder everyone said a shit. I get it. You're telling your life story. Prime is part of your life story. Looks kind of shit. And then the song ended. <laughs> 
Uh, there's a song near the end of there, okay? I, I heard the whole thing, don't worry. Yeah, no, I I think it's, um... I'm trying to be nice to you, KSI, goddammit. If it plays in a Walmart, I'm I'm exiting the Walmart, for sure. No, but not because of the song, because I already got everything I needed and I need to go, but, uh... Another example. If I'm in a taxi and the taxi driver starts playing KSI's new song, I'm exiting that fucking taxi. I, I don't give a fuck, okay? I'm jumping out of the vehicle. And no, it's not because of KSI's song. It's it's because, uh, because the seats were uncomfortable. They had needles in them. <laughs> nah, but... I can tell why someone said this shit's ass, man. But maybe I'm being a bit too unfair, you know? Maybe I'm not giving KSI an opportunity. Why don't we hear from KSI himself? He reacted to various memes on this on this shitty song called "The Hate on My Music Is Forced." No, KSI, it's not forced. We just love making fun of you. But yeah, it's just 20 minutes of KSI getting dumped on by some fans, and it's hilarious to see because it's just pure memes of his song being shit. Like his face slowly turns into the solely sad face. It, it, it's it's hilarious and you know he laughed at one of the tiktoks like in this one <laughs> and you know it's good you gotta laugh in the middle of the hate it's good i got angry with my man ksi <laughs> made fun of nick a30 because he was going yeah yeah out of beat and uh he's in the middle of this. it's actually hilarious nick a30 said this song sounds sick i'm gonna add it to my playlist <laughs> Still KSI, how dare you ruin my king, Nick A30, my favorite Mac crap. I mean, uh, Fortnite YouTuber. I'm a real fan, guys, I'm a real fan. All right, whoever this person is, what the fuck is wrong with you, okay? Don't let the hate get to you, ding! While having an eating lunch leaf. <laughs> like, what the fuck? First of all, what type of grown-ass person eats lunch leaf? Of course, Logan Paul eats lunch leaves while his wife was pregnant, but, you know, that that's just a grown-ass man chat. But you, what the fuck's wrong with you? And he has, he's playing thick of it from KSI while watching the Talk To A podcast, the most brain rot and brainless podcast I've ever fucking seen. How the fuck do you watch, do you hear music while watching Talk To A? This doesn't make any sense. I'm losing my marbles right now. And to just put the cherry on top, recently Dan TDM tweeted out, living the dream, where he posted four pictures of him and his kid, you know, enjoying life, just, you know, enjoying a good old time. And then over here KSI, as sour as he can be, happy for you, bro. You know he's fucking raging right now and then a few days later he uploads the same he mimics the same tweet that dan tdm put out saying living the dream you know with his cats and whatever and it's pathetic case i stop it okay stop it but yeah that's all i wanted to talk about hopefully ksi stops being a sour puss about this but yeah i just wanted to talk a little bit about ksi stuff that's been going on but yeah with that goodbye and i'll see you next time also thank you for over 200 subscribers man i really i really really appreciate it thank you very much